Hey everyone, welcome. I'm Sharon with the Grey Matters blog, and today we're playing Stanley Parable. Because I love this game. We're starting at the beginning because there's a... Or not the beginning, beginning, but we're starting before we get into the game proper. Because I love the guy at the beginning of the credits. Who asked me about my favorite time? Nobody ever asked me that. What is time? Does anyone really, truly know... That is a complicated question, of one of which I do not get paid enough to answer, or really think about overly long, unless Wes asks. Of course they don't. Nobody knows anything. Glad you agree with me. You and I don't even know each other. We're like strangers. Sure, I've adjusted all the game settings to your exact specifications, but who hasn't? Hey, you have done a diligent job, and I am grateful for it. It's just what I do, like a day job. And now, the job is over. No, don't go away. There's no more information for me to gather. I've collected all the data on you that I can. No, there's more to know. And I still don't really know to you. Quit saying what I just said. And you don't know me. I would like to. We could be friends. And neither of us know what time it is. I do too. I'm looking at my phone right now. I'm a few minutes early. I guess some settings are just unsettable. No, we could set all the settings. But if I'm being totally honest, the clock doesn't do anything in this game anyway. You won't have me here when the game starts up next time, but that's okay. It is not okay. We are friends. Video games were meant to be played alone. Really? I love co-op games. You like being alone, don't you? I mean, I am a lot, but, you know, I like company too. If it's the right company. That's maybe the only information I really learned about you. You don't know me. You never knew me. I guess this is where we part ways. Now it's time for me to leave. That's what I just said. There is still one more setting that we need to adjust, but it may take a little time before I'm ready for that. It's not really in my job description, but it's okay. Perhaps you'll see me again. If you can find me. I'm gonna find him. Her. This person. Okay. Into the game. <clears throat> I love the Stanley Parable to d start. That is a truly good start screen thing. Epilogue. There's a few things. I, I looked up some stuff and I really wanted to try. Okay. The end is never the end is never the end is loading. This is the story, story of a man, of a man named Stanley. Stanley. We all know. Okay. All of his co-workers were gone. There's something I wanted to try because I read about Stanley it. decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Somebody told me sometimes you could see... Was that somebody? That sometimes you'll see people walking around in the background. And I think I just saw someone and it's creeping me out a bit. Where are we going today? The bucket asked. Stanley just smiled. Anywhere they went together would be perfectly fine with him. Yeah, Bucket, we Stanley got this. The bucket tightly to his chest and entered the door on his left. Totally doing it, but not because you told me to. I have a plan. Stanley, was here. Stanley needed the Bucket's warmth and comfort now more than ever. Perhaps his boss's office was where he'd find answers. Coming to a staircase, Stanley and the Bucket walked upstairs to the boss's office. We are going to go on an adventure 
and this will be awesome. I've got the feeling money's for stealing, but not yours, of course. Say that's a nice purse. Now, you guys have seen the writing on the wall. Okay, let's see if I can get this here. Stepping. I lost him! <laughs> Getting out of here. We lost the narrator. We lost the narrator. Can you still go down? Should I still go down? No, I gotta check the um thing here because I, I I heard a thing. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do the thing. What thing you may ask? You'll just have to continue watching and find out. Really? The balloons are kind of growing on me. I mean, I wanted the get well eventually balloons. But the happy birthday step niece is starting to grow on me. Okay. We have a door. It's never been opened before. And into the darkness we go. Mwahahahaha. <laughs> Alright. You are now leaving. Yeah, Bucket, we're getting out of here! Escape pod, floor 760. That's only six flights of stairs. I can't do stairs hardly anymore. I mean, sometimes you have to, and I can do it a little bit, but... I've never liked stairs. Stairs are a horrible invention. They're a necessary invention. And yes, I'm aware that I haven't been in shape in years. But I've always hated stairs. Stairs suck. But are a necessary part of life. You know, I think all these are the same. Is every floor exactly the same? Or is that just the same floor over and over and over again? Because it said we had all the different, um... Goodbye, office. Oop. What if? Oh wait, these are like the windows that you can jump out of. Yeah, who cares? I'm getting out of here. Fuck it! We're going! We're escaping! Unlike the lie that is the- Oh, have I taken the bucket through the escape? Okay, we're getting the escape pod. Am I gonna have to leave bucket behind? Bucket. You've meant a lot to me this last few streams. I'm even making kind of a live action thing of you out of a citronella candle. Oh no! We could both fit! No! Bucket! That's okay, Bucket. Go on without me. Be free! I know the building will never let you go. Is that the bucket leaving? Cool! The bucket escaped. Alright. So what are we doing now? So that thing worked. All of his co-workers were gone. What yep. could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Oh! The bucket's gone! Guys! The bucket made it out! And now I'm alone. And I'm lost. And I'm sad. No! Oh, right, not this way, this way. When Stanley um, came to a set of two open doors, this was I wonder if the bucket's like in here somewhere. Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted Shut to up, stop narrator. by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. 
So did I like permanently lose the bucket? Was that like the true ending? To business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Um, no, there was an update to the game. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fine. So I kind of want to see if that unplugging the phone thing still doesn't work. Let's go in here if you don't have the bucket. Because this is like one of the few new things you can do without the bucket. Okay. Stanley had now gotten himself so far off the beaten path that it seemed the office had begun from so far off the beaten path that it seemed the office had begun from so far off the beaten path that it seemed the office this. had begun from so far off the beaten path that it seemed this the is different from so far off the beaten path. Um. You didn't think I was actually just a recording, did you? What a silly and trite explanation that would be. All the back and oh. forth between you and me, all the absurd adventures we've been through, and it all turns out I'm just a tape recording? It was all just in Stanley's head. I bet that's the kind of twist you think is revelatory. I bet each and Re every time you watch a movie where Revolutionary? it turns out all to be in the main character's imagination, you must absolutely bolt off you the know what, man? pure shock at the that phenomenal is... and intricate That is unnecessary. It must be so simple to be you. Life being an unending waterfall of surprises and delights. How much more you know exciting what? you must find being the Being easy the to please you. means that you're pleased mm -hmm. more often. Now I've become sad. Look what you've done to me. This is all your fault. You know what? It's your fault, narrator. It's your fault for not allowing yourself to be happy. I don't say you have to be happy all the time. But there's nothing wrong with being as happy as you want to be. I'm going to go find my bucket. What could it mean? Jerk. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had seen <gasps> Mr. Memo. Replacement bucket! But that's not my bucket. Huh. Okay, I think there's somebody like hiding behind that door frame. And I kind of want to go see. There's no way over there. That is not my bucket. I gotta go try to find another thing I read about. When Stanley hmm. came to a set of two open doors, that's the sound the of me pounding, by the way. Onward, upward, and slightly yeah, to the left. Either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Stanley stepped into the broom closet, but there was nothing here, so he turned yeah, around. Yeah, I've and done got the broom closet track. thing before. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. I'm doing a thing. Silence. I don't need your help, narrator. Money in the morning, money in the evening, money for breakfast, money crisp. That's mixing things up quite a bit. Although it is kind of like the word association, Standing which is my office, head. Stanley was once again stunned to discover uh, yeah, the yeah. indication of any human life. Shocked, unraveled, Stanley wondered in I'm disbelief fine. who orchestrated. Stanley was in such a rush to get through the story as quickly as possible, he didn't even have a single minute to just let the narrator talk. That kind well, of anxiety. Oh, you nix the so he skip button for a few moments with some calming new age music. All right, this isn't bad. You still won't let me have a drink. There needs to be a drunken ending where you just start a bar in your Feeling boss's office. Rejuvenated, Stanley calmly walked forward. Thank you. Passageway. I kind of want to do the one ending again where you just go up and down in the elevator, but I'm on a mission. Yes, yes, mind control facility. La, 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 la. Have I taken the bucket on the escape? I already asked that once today, didn't I? Oh, well. Loading, loading, loading. Descending deeper into the building, Stanley realized he felt a bit peculiar. 
It was a stirring of emotion in his chest, as though he felt I think I had just to tapped a burp. Himself, to question the nature of his job. Why did he feel this now? When for years it had Is there anything interesting in here? Question when you go up and go down, you see different long. things. That is bad elevator maintenance. Stanley walked straight ahead through the large yes, door. Yes, yes. I'm doing facility. it. Silence. Silence you. Okay. All right, we're gonna. Cause uh, you could do this in the original game. And I heard they did something with it. Aha! You've made it to the bottom of the mind control facility. Woohoo! You see, back when the Stanley Parable very first dark. launched in 2013, getting to the bottom of the mind control facility was a bug that we simply didn't catch during development. And you That's all your sent fault. us lots of photos of it on Twitter and acted very superior about it. It was an achievement. Very, very clever. Good for you. Anyway, thank you. When it came time to update the game, we knew that we had to do something about this little goof of ours. So here you go. New content. You can call it the bottom of the mind control room ending. If that is the perception of the value of these updates, isn't that what you crave? New content. Always more content. More content. More, 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 more. There's something up there. Give it to you. I'm here to make it seem like we really covered every nook and cranny of the game with secrets and Easter eggs. Yay! We wrote a new piece of music just for this section. I'm you down. Anywhere else in the game, it's a secret that's just for you. That's how special. Wish I had my bucket. We call this track. Good job! You've made it to the bottom of the mind control facility. Well done. All right. Oh, hey, this is like a proper song. Good job. You did it. Good yeah. Job. Hey, that's terrible. You're here to rock. I don't have my bucket with me. Two, one. Good job. You made it to the bottom of the mind control. I'm sitting over here, like, doing a little dance. I'm enjoying this. Yeah. I was careful. This took work. Used to be a bug. But now it's an ending, now it's an ending I yeah. believe in you, I believe in your ability to cross this barrier And chase your dreams Yeah Your feelings don't mean anything Good yeah. job, you did it Good 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 job, you did it Hey, that's terrible. Obligatory poly armory joke. Job, and yes, it's nice music. I'm enjoying it. Good job. You did it. Good. Job, you did it. We are doing a thing and you stopped. Is that the end? Okay. Now we're going to do the exact same thing with my replacement bucket. Because the original bucket made it out. It, it was a beautiful moment. You missed it. It was truly, truly All moving. We said gone. tearful goodbyes. I stroked Stanley the bucket's chin. The room. Okay, they're not even the saying moment. replacement bucket anymore. There's got to be something going on with these green phones. I saw the guy again. There, there's something over there. I'm probably never going to find out what. A strong bucket. A humble bucket. A committed bucket. A bucket of culture and distinction. Bucket came back. Stanley bucket loves bucket me. Tightly to his chest and entered the door on his left. Yes, it's less terrible. It was, it was all tearful and everything. Still, no one was here. Stanley it's needed fine. the bucket's warmth and comfort now more than ever. Perhaps his boss's office was where he'd coming to a staircase. Stanley and the We're doing a thing, narrator. You are not necessary. Office. Gotta check the poetry, see if there's anything new. I got the feeling money for Stanley. That that was what it was time before last. Really? Okay. Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not Two, an indication of any human. Eight, four, five. Revelation, but Stanley guessed the correct code by sheer luck. It's not luck, it it's bucket knew all along. error and was trial. Mostly a lot of error. Yes, this is certainly the most logical explanation. It is. 
The bucket knows all, hears all, sees all. The bucket might be running this facility. Onward! And loading screen. The bucket and I are gonna go see if the song's still there, and then I can dance with my bucket, and all will be awesome. The elevator raced downward, plummeting towards an unknown fate. Well, I wouldn't say plummeting. Plummeting seems uncontrolled. Together, if not for the bucket, soothing him, comforting him, reassuring that in this darkest moment of uncertainty, he would be all right. It, the bucket is here for you, Stanley. It is. Everything will be fine. The bucket loves me. Stanley and the bucket walk straight ahead through the large door that read. Mind control facility. Hey, that's terrible. Do you remember if we went through the escape thing with the bucket? I honestly cannot remember. I mean, I'm doing this now. Bucket, there's a song. You gotta hear this. But just a stand okay, we'll do that next. Into the mind control facility, he tripped and fell over the railing and I into wouldn't the call that below. tripped. That Thankfully, was more a onto the bucket, which um, purposeful jump. Now, what to do next? Stanley wondered. Stanley and the bucket Where's my song? No way out of this enormous pit, and so eventually they decided that the best thing to do would be to simply get comfortable down here. Okay. So they set up a little couch and relaxed. It really oh. wasn't so bad down here. A bit cold, perhaps. That's a nice... After some time had gone by... They hey, this is lovely! Well, ...and a sort of kitchenette that was useful for when the bucket was craving paninis. I want a panini. It wasn't until the rugs and the standing lamps came in that it really started to feel like a home. In fact, after some time, Stanley realized that it had been ages since he had even thought of the mind control facility at all. Oh, well, it He's is nice never down here. To fully explore what was up there. Never been able to unearth the many mysteries of the mind yeah, control Yeah, but this facility. is fine. This lack of closure began to eat at him. Soon he How was big is this down place, here? And the state of their home slowly decayed as Stanley became withdrawn and neglected the cleaning. It unsettled the bucket deeply. Stanley wasn't usually like this. The bucket tried eh, to reach out to him again, mugs. but to no avail. All Stanley could think about, all he could talk about, was going back, doing it over again, staying on the path. No. It was a mistake to leave the path. It was a mistake. It was a mistake. It's I never a mistake. What the narrator says. I need to see the truth. Oh, ending. you wish. This made no sense at all to the bucket was simply trying to live its life down here as comfortably as possible. Yet Stanley was unconsolable. This isn't Stanley an ending. Stanley is very this consolable. Is just a hole in the ground. The bucket sighed. True, it wasn't an ending. That's because he didn't play the song. Be. And maybe, possibly, if we accept the reality of things, maybe this will become an ending eventually. It's what the bucket was counting on. The two bucket. of them waited for a very long time. Bucket. That 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 feels kind of depressing, really. I think I'm sad now. Okay, we're gonna go escape. The bucket made it out on its own. Maybe the escape works with the bucket. I can't wait to tell this story to my co-workers. Stanley thought, how amusing they'll find it. Oh, won't we all just laugh and laugh at the time I thought everyone had gone missing? No. Stop putting words in my mouth. Ah, the embrace of an old friend. A weathered companionship that stands the test of time. Yeah, there's definitely something there the first time you look, but only once. I, I'm not imagining this. I am not. Probably. Maybe I need to go do the adventure line thing. I, th I think I did that once already. Stanley clutched the bucket tightly to his chest and entered the door on his left. Yep. But not because I'm doing what you say, because I'm doing Still my own no thing. Here. 
Stanley Although me and the narrator are on pretty good the terms the right now. Perhaps his boss's office I also don't think I've gone status. downstairs Stanley with the bucket, the bucket, have I? Upstairs to the boss's office. Mm. I don't know, I'm losing all sense of time and space. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get some new material, wall. I'll even close it behind me. That's a polite thing to do. I could go back. Nah. Stepping into his We're getting out of here. Stanley and together. Was again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. Crushed by the weight of this Don't care. Stanley may have, but Stanley guessed the correct code by sheer luck. Was it that the bucket knew all along? Nope. Or was the bucket guiding him? Yes. Nope. This is certainly the most logical explanation. I have stolen this knowledge from you and it no longer belongs to you. Alright. Here we go. Bucket escape. Now I wonder since it's no longer a placement bucket on the sticker. Whether or not this is the original bucket that just came back to me even though I set him free. Or whether or not this maintenance, or whether or not this Stanley is, you know, a new bucket. Through the large door that read, nope. Mind control facility. Although this passageway had the word escape written on it, the truth was that at the end Don't of care. the school, Stanley and the bucket would both meet a violent death. Going out together, we've done it before. The door behind them was not shut. Stanley and the bucket still had every opportunity to turn around and get back on track. Oh, exactly. A painful death for each of them. Nope. Don't care. Going on. Ride or die! Thud. Cool. Okay, we're, we're going back to... I think the drop is longer this time. Hmm. Narrator, you got anything to say about the this? Word into motion and Stanley ah. and the bucket inch closer to their demise, Stanley reflected on how meaningless the bucket's warmth and comfort had turned out to be. Shut your mouth! Sure, it puts the mind and the soul at ease to embrace the bucket. But what use is a sense of ease? No, bucket. I could throw him onto the catwalk. And he ah. sort of kicked himself ah. for wasting so much time carrying a bucket everywhere. I was going Farewell, to do that Stanley. anyway. You didn't say goodbye to the bucket. Where are we Farewell, going? Well, Stanley cried the narrator, as Stanley and the bucket were led helplessly into the enormous metal jaws. Um. In a single visceral instant. The bucket's life came to an end as no. it was crushed violently to death. No. Okay, so there's that way. Can't go this way. Maybe this is escape. It was a shame, the death of such a magnificent bucket. I it's know, true that right? All buckets are radiant in their own way. But this one stood above the rest. It was a glorious bucket to behold. It truly is. Let's see here. The bucket welcome to welcomes you to the grand exhibit. You are now standing at the precipice of knowledge. Much like the bucket itself, the human mind is frequently empty within. A cavernous void. I own that. But through use of the exhibit in front of you, the mind becomes full and a rich and substantiated knowledge of the bucket and its history is the only true knowledge we truly have. Will you take what you learn here out with you into the world? Bucket, this is your life. Yes. Will you accept with an open wine mind what may be challenging about the information in this exhibit? Probably not. Will you change the lives of yourselves and your loved ones as a result of this exhibit? Almost definitely not. Or will you turn to blind eye and continue to live your life as you were in ignorance and darkness? It is kind of dark in here right now. 
And I'm cool with that. Because I don't Can want it to. see how arrogant it was for Stanley to take a bucket like this Aww. and to claim it for his own? Can you see the hubris they that They took my bucket. Him? Can you see that the bucket is far more noble than Stanley will ever be in his short life? Well, it is a bucket. 25 buckets. A ph photograph of 25 buckets. I'm not going to count that. The greatest number of buckets ever captured on camera. The photographer experienced catatonic shock for several weeks as a result of the euphoria for from exposure to this many buckets at once. Oh, so it's like the elephant's foot. If you haven't looked up the elephant's foot, look it up. It's like a real life creepy pasta. Ooh. A bucket with two handles. This bucket is depicted as having two handles. Such a design has never been created in real life. Bow chicka exposure. Yes. The buckets have exposed themselves. <gasps> no. Having been deemed too dangerous and recklessly experimental. Every year dozens are put to death for just attempting it. By who? I need to know. And give me back my bucket. It's my bucket. We're friends. Inferno bucket. A replica of the Inferno Bucket, which is in the medieval era, was so powerfully alluring that it drove dozens of nations to war with one another for control of it. Billions dies, and yet, it, in spite of it all, the simple fact remains. No one can control a bucket. I mean, it could be like a Helen of Troy bucket, I suppose. That's epic. Got some music going on here. Cave drawing. While we know that the bucket predates the existence of mankind, we do not know for by how long. This cave drawing depicts early man's discovery of the practical uses of the bucket, by which time the bucket had already likely been around for several millennia. Notice in these drawings how the bucket is allowing itself to be used, having judged humanity to be worthy of its treasure. Well, now I know this is not correct. Okay, I'm going back the other way to see what was over here. The stress bucket, presented without commentary. Coping strategies <laughs> equals whole. Rest and relaxation, relaxation doing something you enjoy. Rest and relaxation. Stress equals the level of water in the bucket. What does that say up there? Worrying, negative forecasting, negative thinking, lack of reassurance. Vulnerability equals size and strength of the bucket. You know that that's not a bad just thing. And it's up here by itself. I could sit in the chair and just look at it. No, no, I can't. It's not going to let me. But no man can own a bucket. And certainly that's what not the a thing bucket said. as dazzling to behold as this one. It is man who should kneel before the bucket. I mean, they probably can't do worse than man. The hanging bucket. This piece symbolizes the necessary relationship between bucket and humanity. However clear a grasp of the bucket may be, there is yet more that is always out of reach. This distance, inevitably, is for our own good. No! Bucket! Hey! It's the hole! Bucket! It's the hole! But there is something we can do. Something we can do together, you and I, that will right this terrible wrong. What's that? Let Stanley die. Let him be crushed by the machine. Don't lose um. the game. Don't give him another opportunity to run off with another beautiful bucket. We can save the I freed that bucket. As tools and implements. If only we let Stanley die together, the bucket shall take its place as ruler. As Lady, leader, as you have a problem. A new world, a new bucket! 
That was a very smooshy sound. And I do not appreciate it. Okay. Before I leave today, I'm going to try the without the bucket unplugging the phone thing. Because they didn't update and they might have fixed it. I really don't remember what all I've done with the bucket. All of his co-workers were gone. What yes, yes. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. I still got to do the, the epilogue. He wanted to be a better man and a better co-worker. In time, perhaps, he would be nah, both fine. of those Stanley clutched the bucket tightly to his... This was not the correct way bucket to... Bucket knows what he's doing. But Stanley had felt the bucket calling to him, telling him that the employee lounge was simply the place to be. And here yep. it was. Had the bucket turned out to be correct? Was this better? No, never mind. The bucket was Shut wrong. your mouth. Stanley took the door on his left to go back to the meeting room. See, gotta try to remember now, all the stuff I've done, and just all the Don't stuff I've read about. Room. Go somewhere else. The cargo oh. lift, yes. Good, said the bucket. Now ride the lift all the way to the top. There's something up there <laughs> I need you to do. Stanley did not question why or how this bucket was speaking to him. I don't think the it bucket is speaking him, course, to me. I think the narrator but Stanley is chose not to think putting more and opening. He unthinkingly did whatever the bucket asked. Nope. Come on, we're gonna go find the red and blue door. Okay. He said, there's so much I can't remember if we did. No, stop. Look there on the wall. You see, there's a sign right there. It says, no buckets past this point. Stanley, how could you think it was well, that's okay to bring the here? Unless, what if the problem is that you actually don't know what is a bucket and what isn't a bucket? I, I know what I know a lot about your behavior up to this point, which if that's probably true, well, my goodness, I think we have to do something about it. This misunderstanding could have dire consequences on the entire rest of the game. That's if not fine. Quickly and properly. So much of the impact of the story is dependent on your understanding of what is and isn't a bucket. Please step in here for a moment. Yeah, why not? I got nothing else to do. <sighs> Stretch. Wow. My back just made a popping noise so loud I'm surprised y'all didn't hear it. Now then, I'm going to run you through some test scenarios and you'll tell me whether or not the thing I'm showing you is a bucket. Simply enough, right? This should yes. tell us everything we'll ever need to know about what is or is not a bucket. I don't trust okay, you. Do, do, do. Item one. Is this a bucket? I'm just going to say no to everything. No. Correct. It is a hologram of a bucket, not an actual bucket. You heard it from here, but not in your headphones. It is seen that law. Left. No. Nothing's a bucket. Correct. This is not it even is a, a bucket. This is a superior being. A bucket, not an actual bucket. Hmm. Item three. Is this Trying a to find a way to escape. No. Incorrect. This is a bucket. I don't believe you. Item four. Is this a bucket? Um. Okay, this is warring with my instincts because. Uh, I want to say nothing is a bucket, but I also really want to say that this is a bucket because it is obviously not a bucket. Now, I'm, I'm sticking with my thing. Nothing's a bucket. Correct. This is a tractor and not a bucket. To be honest, I just sort of put this one in here as a gimme, but I was starting to get concerned that even this might be too much for you. Thank you for not making me look like an idiot. Okay, next one. Oh, you don't need any help from me. Come on, come on. Is this a it doesn't even have a bucket on it. No. Incorrect. This is a bucket. Is its name Bucket? Is it Charlie Bucket the Tractor? 
Item six. Is this a bucket? No. Trick question. Both. Gotcha. It is both a bucket and not a bucket. Item... Wait, hold on. I can't find the next one. Let me see. It should be around here somewhere. I kind of want to know what happens if you say everything wrong. Yes. Thank you. There's nothing here. <laughs> of course it isn't a bucket. We both know full well that nothing isn't a bucket. Wait, when I say Maybe? nothing isn't a bucket, that makes it sound like I'm saying everything is a bucket. Charlie, shun the non-believer. Shun. Answer me straight, Stan. Shun. Trying to tell me shun. Everything is a bucket. I haven't looked at film cow in forever. You know what? I'm too confused to even sort it out. I've lost That's all your sense problem. of perspective. What is a bucket? What isn't a bucket? Mere moments ago, I could answer these questions with confidence. And yet now, I'm somewhat adrift. Do any of us know... I may have to do this a second time and, and answer I all of them correctly to see what... Uh... Andy, I can't keep doing this. I'm losing myself, and myself was all I ever had to begin with. I'm afraid the bucket is threatening mm -hmm. to tear our relationship apart. I can't help no, sorry. I love the bucket I more than you. It's not tearing us apart. Human. We were never a thing. Okay. You've been stalking me. Hello? What happened? Is everything gone? Why did everything disappear? Wait, was everything a bucket? Every single thing... No, nothing is a, is a bucket. You said Why that, and I agreed no with you. How could... Except me. I'm not a bucket after all. And you, Stanley... That's debatable. You're here. You're not a bucket either. Of course I'm not. News. We're not buckets. Yes, okay. I actually feel much more at ease right now. It's delightful to get some I clarity may on that issue. Do that later and see if you answer everything correctly and see if so, tell you what, something different happens. We said everything and we'll put back all of the buckets, okay? And we'll cool. know that it's all a bucket. But if you run into anyone else, maybe don't mention that. Who knows what that information might do to a person? All right. Make them laugh. Go. The end, the, end, the, end, the end is never the end, 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 is never the end. Se, se nest pas un se. I butchered that, I'm sure. All of his co workers were gone. What could it mean? Stan uh, decided to go Saturday? to the Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Okay. Ha. I swear to God there's something there every time you look. I'm probably wrong. I'm definitely Not wrong. So lucky to have a bucket, but still I know. A very lucky fellow. Very lucky indeed. Hey, can I have the you found it? Stanley clutched the music again to his chest. And entered the door on his left. Great feathered gods. Uh, do I want to go this way? Do I want to go that way? Yeah, I don't. I this don't know what all I've done with the bucket the or not. But Stanley had felt the bucket calling to him, telling him that the employee lounge was simply the place to be. And here yep. it was. Had the bucket turned out to be correct? Was this better than the meeting room? Yes. yes, Stanley thought to himself. Yes, perhaps it truly was. How insightful the bucket turned out to be. Oh, that's nice. Looks like a motivational poster without the... Can I have a cold drink? Truly, being here with the bucket was a grand adventure. Stanley reflected on all they'd been through Something's together. happening. First, walking through the door on the right. Then walking to the lounge, then arriving at the lounge. What a thrilling journey the bucket had inspired. Wait, it's like, almost like you can climb the drink machine? Perhaps this was where the bucket felt most truly at home. Here in the employee lounge. Perhaps it's the only place a bucket can even feel at home. I don't know, I think he and the broom closet had Finally, a thing going. The bucket was done being in the lounge. And they took the first open door on their left to get back to business. 
Yeah, sure, why so not? The two of them detoured through the maintenance section and walked straight Oh, wait, to the I already did door. the bucket destroyer. Did I? No, I'm doing this. I may have done it already, but I'm confused. So we're doing this thing. Whether we've done it before or not, we're doing it now. Uh, at least it's quiet in here now. Earlier today, oh, there was a caravan of trucks holding way. some of the I hauling some of the biggest pipe initially. I've ever seen. You see, your I mean, my house could fit in some of this. We've come together here because oh, we care indeed. about you very much. It's this bucket you're carrying around everywhere. The bucket isn't even from the original Stanley Parable. It's just sequel content. We're the Pencil ones that matter, Stanley. Classic Et characters two. from the first game, like the Adventure Line and the Broom Closet. Because that's what fans want from a sequel. They want more of their favorite baby. jokes. Not this bucket. I see you're never staying out of the before. fire. Yes, I know I'm the one who My gave you the bucket. But you're spending too much time with it. Don't you want another story involving the adventure line? I really do. We can make do. the adventure line go somewhere new. Yes, yes, that's what the fans want. Let's do it. I'm down. I mean, I don't trust you. Can I escape? No. Nah. Fine adventure line. Look at that wacky line. Who knows where it'll go off to next? Oh, and it played some silly music as well. Yes, put the music back on. Dum 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 da da dum da dum dum. Now this is what the Put the, the music is all back about. on. Don't you remember all those great jokes from the original dialogue? I also do. Stanley We're just addicted to drugs and hookers. <laughs> eh. <laughs> yes. It's as classic now as it was back then. Let's do it for the fans, Stanley. Let's give them more content exactly like this. But if we want to do that, you're Put going the to song have to back give on. Up. No. Uh, this is a trick, isn't it? Um. Don't you get it, Stanley? We need to get rid of the bucket. No. That's why I'm very proud to introduce a brand new character. This is the Bucket Destroyer. I, oh. True, it also was not in the original game, but it's such a well-fleshed-out character with so I much will personality not. that to me, it already feels as though it's been part of the cast all Let along. Let me out. Don't you agree? Let me out. Can Adventure you line, you're a traitor. Does? Surely you don't need me to spell it out for you. That's a chair. Maybe I can go, go up now, there. Stanley. Say goodbye to the bucket, and then pop it into the machine no. when you're ready. No. No. I'm not even going up there. Nope. No. I sound like a little sister. No. No. Now listen to me. It's crucial that you give it the bucket. I, I don't, don't want know what to. the bucket destroyer will do if it can't destroy your bucket. Destroying That's your problem. It's all it knows. That is its singular personality trait. Sure, mm. I can hear you saying, how does a character with only one personality trait deserve to join the pantheon of beloved Stanley Parable characters? It does well, not. See, if you were to really explore the bucket Venture destroyer, line, you you'd bastard. see that its desire to crush buckets is so densely loaded with complexity and nuance that it's really no. like ten personality traits. Can't what hear you over the machine. Can you even say that about? The broom closet? Certainly not. I wonder what sort of bucket destroyer Escape. merchandise the fans will be clamoring for after this. I'm making okay, my own merch, so you're not selling anything. Upset now. You'll have to hurry and feed it. We Fine. Can't get back to the Stanley ha! The bucket won't like go. The adventure line or the bucket destroyer until you crush that damn bucket. Quickly no. now. The fans are waiting. Do it, the fans, Stanley. Give the fans no. what they want. No. The hurry fans and... want the bucket. Bam, indeed. Oh. creation you had so much potential we were going to do such marvelous things with you tell such spell binding stories about you all of it squandered now 
Goodbye, Somehow I doubt it. For the moment in time Although the writers of the Stanley Parable could pull it off better than most anyone. Let's see. Because I can't remember what all we've done and haven't done and going back to watch some of our old streams would require time that frankly I don't really have. I mean I could make the time. Maybe I'll go back and watch like the last well the last one because one before this is gone because I can or only keep two gone. weeks worth of what recordings. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had We're going to go actually up so the lift. Stanley checked his ego and then proceeded onward. Stanley clutched the bucket. My ego doesn't need it. checking. It's carry on. But Stanley had felt the bucket calling to him, telling him that the M Yes, yes, yes. Was simply the place to be. And no, the was. bucket is wrong. The bucket turned out to be correct. No, never mind. Come on, the bucket. Was bucket. Wrong. Stanley took the door on his left to go back to the meeting room. Okay, we're gonna now, go do the phone the bucket, ending, and, and then we're the gonna do the room, unplug ending, else. and then before the we go, I'm gonna try yes. the unplug Good, ending without the bucket, the bucket to now see if that works. All the way to the top. There's something up there I need you to do. Stanley did not question why. Why do you sound like you want to do bad things, Bucket? I mean, him, of course, because buckets can't talk. But Stanley the heck you say? This obvious fact. Stray balloons. He was convinced that the bucket had spoken to him, and he it's fine. He did whatever the bucket asked. It's absolutely fine. Nothing bad will ever happen because of this bucket. In here, said the bucket. Go into this dark room over here. Stanley no. once again obeyed blindly. I don't wanna. I mean, I kind of have to. Now pick up the phone, said the bucket. Cool. All right, where are we going, bucket? Bucket! Where are we going? Uh, okay, so, since you're the one talking on the stream, this or anybody else who's watching, do you want to do the time, ending I that froze Stanley last bucket, time, or do you want to do the epilogue before we leave? And then, very distressingly, he began to believe the bucket could speak to him. Jim. Jim. Jim, Jim. Is there anywhere else I can go around here? The froze ending? Yeah, I want to see what if I can actually get that to work, or, you know... This is nice. See, when the bucket's here, I actually get my beautiful house. And not my beautiful wife. Hello, Stanley, it's me, your bucket. Press circle to take me to work with you. The Stanley Parable Reassurance Bucket was merely meant to provide the comforting glow of companionship. It doesn't literally talk and give you orders. Whatever Stanley is hearing doesn't the it? bucket say to him is just in his head. Nah. Fine. Okay. Oh, come on. You don't want to go on an adventure here? Lately, That's true. We go on adventures about all the time. Wouldn't you be concerned as well? To see him delusional like Oh, this, don't worry about me. Over an inanimate metal the Buckin and I have plans I for you. Him, but I don't know how I can convince him. I don't know if he'll listen to me. Well, probably not. I rarely do. Go back to work. Well, I'll try anyway. Stanley, can you hear me? Listen can't to me. Can hear you, just it's not listening. It's just a bucket. It can't think. Hmm. It can't talk. All what it if would I do ever this? truly do for you is effectively transfer a liquid from one location to a different location. I'm That's gonna it. break the game. It doesn't do anything else. Can can I break the game? I want to break the game. Okay, I'm on the chair. Do they actually think to block the desk? God damn it, they know their player as well. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Don't listen to the loud man. Press triangle for us to go back home. You see, he's not listening. 
I really am not. Orders from the bucket. You know, I like the bucket time, more than you. Me he took orders from me. He trusted I don't like to. you. Now all he cares about is his awful bucket. His stupid hunk of metal. The bucket loves me. Press circle to ignore everyone in your life except for me. It's sad. I suppose he doesn't need me anymore. From I really on, don't. He's just going to cling to this bucket, this cold, empty bucket. This you introduced sort of me to that bucket. bucket. Hmm. Well, I'll give it this. The bucket does have a nice shine to it. It does. It really does. You believe I'm real, don't you, Stanley? Press circle to go back home. Yes, I suppose on closer inspection that it doesn't quite look like your average hardware store bucket. It's just a little more, um, what am I trying to say? Stern, but to watch it. More capable Static of channel. Liquid. That's right. Like it would be better at moving an amount of water from one room to another. Meh. Press up arrow to relive the same day with me over and over. Not every day is the same. Oh my god, what am I saying? Better at carrying water from room to room. It's a bucket. It's literally just a bucket. The hell you, you say? To point out the ways in which it's my so bucket transforms into a, a giant bucket. monster. Press X to go home, to work, to home, to work, to home. Oh no. I'm... I'm having feelings. Keep them to the yourself. No, 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 that no, is no, my bucket. Get your own. The bucket? Hear what the bucket has to say. Do anything oh, it asks. bucket. That's all you? nice and relax. Uh, romantic. Look at the confusing. candles. <laughs> I'm gonna burn myself tell alive. Me what to do in this troublesome situation? No. Stanley, give me the bucket. Give no. It to me. Give me the bucket, Stanley. I need no. it. No. Give it to me now. Give it, or I'll. I closed my eyes. Go back to work, Stanley. I. Okay. He better not have taken my bucket. Okay, now we're going to unplug the phone and see what happens. All right. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided Don't care. to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Yeah, there's there is Stanley something there. I'm not crazy. Embrace, protective, yet delicate, assertive, yet compassionate. Nope. Stanley clutched the bucket tightly to his chest. This was not the correct way to the meeting room. Don't care. Stanley had felt the bucket calling to him, telling Doing him a that thing. the employee lounge was simply the place to be. And here it was. Had the bucket turned out to be correct? No. Nope. Never mind. The bucket was wrong. The bucket usually Stanley is because while he is a very good friend, he is also no, not the greatest the judge bucket. of um, Don't go to the meeting room. Go somewhere a good else. time. The cargo lift, yes. Good, said the bucket. Now ride the lift all the way to the top. There's something up there I need you to do. Is there Stanley really? Did not question why or how this bucket was speaking to him. It should have I mean, you don't need to try to manipulate me. I, I, we're, we're, we're together to in this bucket. He was I want to go on that walkway. And he unthinkingly did whatever the bucket Not asked. that there's not plenty of stuff in the game. Literally, I can't remember everything I've done. In here, said the bucket. Go into this dark room over here. Stanley you know, bucket, again, you're getting a little blind. bossy. I have a plan. Now pick up the... F <laughs> oh, hold on. Why did you unplug the Because I want to. Were you trying to resist the bucket's orders? Stanley, I was joking. Obviously, the bucket isn't talking to you and telling you to do things. Buckets can't talk. It was a joke. Don't you get the joke? It's funny, Stanley. A talking bucket. Don't uh, care. Can't you see? Oh, oh, goodness. I must have really bungled up the delivery if you actually took me seriously. Where did I mess up the joke? Should I have paused for longer Wee. or spoken quicker? Oh, comedic timing is so difficult. I it is. I better at it, but there isn't exactly an instructional video on comedy that one can watch to fully... Oh, wait, yes, there Dude, is. Dude, go to YouTube. Um, it's sitting right here. Let's take a look. In the tape room. Green Mother, so what, what are you doing now? What is comedic timing? What is comedic timing? 
How does it work? <laughs> I'm playing Stanley How Terrible. It How can it be used to effectively silence your political enemies? Yeah. And more importantly, the answer to all of these questions is yes. Let's dive deeper. Ray? Cool. If you've ever told a joke or made someone laugh, in all likelihood, you did it while standing 50 to 80 centimeters from them in a room of no more than 76 degrees Fahrenheit. Green mother, don't you have a job? Arms raised straight upward Maybe I do. Angle Maybe I body. don't. These are the optimal conditions for good comedic timing. To begin the joke, start by stating and spelling your name. Next, provide a <laughs> brief synopsis of the joke including the specific times at which the recipient of the joke admit will nothing laugh, indeed and then spell out your name a second time with these steps complete it's time to begin the humor Speak cool the entire joke in no more than 18 seconds and no less that than would take 13 a, and a that half that would be quite a only feed. for bathroom breaks when necessary <laughs> when the joke has concluded it is customary to inform your listener that the joke is over by declaring in your loudest possible voice I'm Dunny with the funny. Everybody Let's say it together. Screening. I'm Dunny with the funny now. I'm Dunny with the funny. I don't know. I don't think this brand of humor works for me. I'm more of a dry humor type of gal. Hello? Raider. Good. This saying is a perfect example of expectations management, which is the <laughs> cornerstone of good comedy. Finally, it's time to hand out surveys. Collecting That's terrible. Does she ever not look at you funny? Throughout the joke also the tell her I said hi. As a comedian. An effective survey should be no less than 10 pages long and should include the Ooh. same question reprinted several times. Just to ensure the survey taker is actually paying attention and not simply filling in answers at random. And that's all there is. With these strategies at your disposal, you'll have audiences doubled over in laughter and even tripled over in laughter in no time at all. That sounds Just remember painful. To let them stop laughing at some point, you gut busting little scamp. After all, with each of us needed on the front lines of the war to fight the 12 legged invader who threaten our very existence and to very likely die in a hailstorm of bullets. That and one mammals. needs to shave its All leg. Of us must be prepared to give our lives to this noble cause, just as our children must do after <laughs> us and their children after them. Godspeed and may Earth reign supreme. I have so many questions. But I'm hey, too lazy to ask. This them. video is a little outdated, isn't it? Well, no matter. Uh, I think the fundamentals of proper or ahead of its time are still as relevant today as they were back then. So, with that in mind, I believe the only way forward is for us to return to the two doors and walk through all of this again, so I can try telling my story with more appropriate comedic delivery. Come along. All right. Let's head back. Let's do this. All right. Oh, they knew I was going to try to jump off, didn't they? I can feel it. This time, I'm really going no! to nail the delivery. You'll be in stitches. A talking Let me out. Say Let me throw ridiculous. myself to oh, my death. Sir, what a hilarious concept. The king of comedy. That's what you'll call me. I will Thank not. We have the instructional video. Otherwise, who knows where we'd be right now? Well, I wouldn't be the king of comedy, <laughs> that's for sure. The bucket spoke to Stanley. Hmm. The bucket spoke. The bucket spoke. Oh, I'll figure it out. How on far the back am I going? Think things. I mean, you do, dude. It, it, it's kind of one of your defining characteristics. This is a nice meeting room. Or not meeting room. Yeah, break room. Our break room had a refrigerator. Last time... I was at a place with an office, and it always smelled oh, kind of funny. Really? <clears throat> when Stanley and the bucket came to a set of two open doors, they entered the door on the left. Now, does he actually want me to go on the left, or does he want me to go on the right? I'm going to the left. No, 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 no. You were supposed to go through the door on the right, leading back to the phone. Did you not even look at the instructional video? I think this is all covered very clearly. There's no way I Don't can make care. the comedic timing work now. It's done. The joke is completely done and over. It's all your fault, Stanley. 
I'm going Probably. to be ridiculed in the community of other joke writers. I'm going to be shamed at every one of our meetings from now on. Or uh -huh. because you couldn't watch a simple video and take a hint. Are you proud of yourself for bringing me down, it's Stanley? Extremely. Hey. Here we go. You ready? <clears throat> When Stanley and the Bucket came to a set of two open doors, they entered the um, door left. N yes. No, 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 no. You were supposed to go through the door on the right, leading back. <laughs> Here we go. You ready? <clears throat> when Stanley and the Bucket came to a set of two open doors, they entered the door. Doing the it left. again. No, 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 no. You were supposed to go through the door on the right, leading back. This is just Here the way it goes now. <clears throat> when I'm gonna Stanley do it one more time. A set of two open Actually, doors, I'm running late on this. Well, yeah. We'll actually do what we're supposed to do. Well, uh, we're back at the phone already. No, no, no. What's going on? There were supposed to be several rooms leading up to this. There was supposed to be a build-up to this point. A dramatic display um, of remarkable comedic wit which culminates in this scene with the phone. Dude, you have a real problem with timing. We we have run into this before. And it's all my fault. I must Yes, it is. The phone room comes immediately after the two doors room. What an egregious mistake. I made a fool of myself. I don't You just spent time and space again. I'm nothing. I'm not even the lowliest joke telling well. I think I think I need to go back and rewatch that instructional video again. Make it's sure so you yell out, I'm Dunny with the funny. Where? Stanley, you would have the bucket so much, it's like you... Um, it's as though all of your other most prized possessions... I've clipped out of the game. Comparison. Yes. Let, well, let me try that again, Stanley. I heard that you are... Oh, well, this Dave. looks all so official. ...in love with the bucket you are. No? 22nd century toys. Sony PlayStation third party relations. Woot. This is well as meta as everything else going on in here. Okay. Yes. Okay. Do I just... Okay, it's restarting on its own. Okay, I was actually going to go see if the, um... thing worked, but... Uh, you know what? I got nowhere to be right now. We'll, we'll go see if I can break the game.